what's up guys welcome back i'm your humble host picasso thanks for joining in today guys i am back at it again and you know what that means it's theming time okay so i finished that recent theme the hello theme i put that up i got some great responses you know some great love uh putting that out all over the place uh instagram facebook twitter google plus um, I really love the theming and I really want to take it a lot more serious and I'm really trying to get deeper into it and get more creative. Okay. I love fingerprint icons. I love that. Okay. So, you know, don't hate on that if you see that a bit often, but it's obviously, it's not the only thing I've ever done. And I'm using widget locker, of course, which, um, I missed widget locker. I really have where I'm able to make my own lock screen, my own custom lock screen. So I really love that. Okay. So tapping on that's gonna bring us to our home screen okay now on our home screen you can see here it's this is just bare bones okay now in that corner right there you can see that it has applications okay now obviously if you go ahead and tap applications it's going to bring up um, what I'm using is app swap it's a third-party app drawer that I really fall in love with you can put third-party icon packs you can change the theme of the drawer and uh, yeah, it's pretty cool. Swiping to the right will automatically open the Play Store. Swiping to the left will automatically open uh, Google. Okay, Google search, so awesome. Uh, the, the icon pack that I'm using there is Min, the Min icon pack, M-I-N. Let's see, scale out, let's go scale out vertically. I think that's what I should have used. 
yeah like scale out vertically something like that okay and then let's copy these copy let's go ahead and drop them on the second one let's go to animation let's paste that but we want to go in the opposite way so scale out vert actually is it that way no i think it would be um where is it okay well not module top left module top right but it should be scale out vertically there's no there's no inverted for that there's supposed to be something i'm trying to remember background scroll Screen two, module top right. Something about inverted, but I don't see inverted. Screen top, right? Oh, interesting. Okay, all right. Now we're getting somewhere. <laughs> now we're getting somewhere. But it is scroll. It's scrolling not the way I want it. So on the second one, I want it to come from the other side. Now I need another one. Do I need another one? I actually think that I need another one. I might have to make these squares a little bit smaller. But just, just to figure out what we want to do, let's just try it. I'm going to move that. Oops, sorry. I'm going to move that above here. So all I did was made a copy. So let's see which one we have here. Let's go ahead and um, let's move the top position. Let's move it up. So we can actually see what's going on here. Let's go ahead, save. Now let's, okay. All right, so that's what we got now. We have that, okay? So we have that animation. All right, I'm gonna go over the animations and what I've done after. So let's take a look now. So which one is this? That's the top. Okay, so this one, that's coming down from the middle right there, or from the top center. So this one, we need this guy to go, to come in from the left side of the screen. They're both coming in from the right, we need it to come in from the left side. That's what's giving me some trouble, how to get it in from the left side. Module top left module top right same thing so what do we need to do here what am I missing I know I'm missing something guys but what am I missing which one is this which one am I on I'm on the center one I think the center one is fine right no okay so the center one is the one I'm on okay uh, we want to scroll okay that's right scroll vertically vertically wait a minute we got it we got it folks we got it wow what was I missing I do not know what I was missing but we got it let's see okay all right so module center uh, I think we had screen top left for the other one so let's go screen top right there we go there we go there we go, folks. Oh my gosh. Okay. <laughs> okay, we got it. Let's go ahead and save. I don't know what we were missing. I don't know what I was doing wrong, but let's let's figure it out. Okay, so now it's time to reshape. And I'll figure out what I'm gonna do with it after. So let's go back, let's go back, let's go back. All right, shape one, which is the top. So we're actually gonna start with the bottom. Okay, so the bottom shape. We want to change that. Um, let's let's see. I guess the size. So bottom shape. We're going to set 160. Let's bring it to about one, and let's bring it to about. Let's say four, 400. So 400 by 100. Okay, and we are going to bring it down. I know I have the nav bar buttons here, so I'm going to bring it to about there. Let's save. Let's take a look how close that is to the nav buttons. That's actually pretty good. Have some space there. Could put something there. Maybe applications. Not sure yet. Um, 
I am going to show you guys uh, what we did uh, to get this of course so we got that 400 by 100 position is uh, negative 100 1000 we can easily see that let's go to the middle one so it's 400 by 100 let's go ahead and save position and then move it over to negative 100 now let's bring it down to about I want it close but not too close so maybe right there uh, might round the corners a little bit let's go back here so again 400 by 100 save position oh, let's go ahead and bring it down and bring it over let's go ahead and hit save so, so it might just make it uh, transparent around the corners just a little bit just a bit let's save so switching switching to the next page we have that so first page this is what we got and then switching to the second page we got that okay, so let's go back and take a look and see what we did and see how we got the animation done let's go ahead and save so first off we created three shapes okay we laid them sized them out and uh, starting from the top we basically got our size and we went in and did animation now first animation we did was we added a background scroll Okay, the action, what it does is scroll on the background. I set it to screen two, it's two screens, so the first screen is blank. Scrolling to the second screen is gonna bring out our rectangle uh, uh, platforms, or our rectangle docks, or just call them docks, whatever. And um, the first one, it's just regular scroll, it's set to screen two, okay, and that's it. That's literally it. The second time now we added, uh, uh, it reacts on the background scroll, and then it scales out vertically and we have it going to the module top left okay so it's going to the top left not screen left top left okay is that what it is hold on module top left yeah wait which one are you on but it's not going left it's going right okay i guess it's it's oh it's scrolling out vertically it's scrolling out uh, to the top left okay we can work on that, but that's basically what that was. Um, for the second shape, what do we have? Let's go to the animation. We have a scale out vertically and screen top right. So where is it? It's going to the left. Is this inverted? Okay, I am confusing myself a little bit, but you guys are seeing it right here. You're seeing all the, the variables and everything that we did. Screen top right. So that's where it's... <laughs> confused oh wait 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 because it's on the second screen is it yes it's on the second screen okay now I'm feeling like we should put it on the first screen but anyway I'll leave that till another time and you know what no I'm gonna put it on the first screen so let's go and put it on screen one save we're gonna put it on screen one and then scroll inverted scroll inverted that's where we got it. The action is scroll inverted, so that's why it's going to that side. Okay, okay, okay. I got it, I got it. So I know it might be a little bit confusing, but you can always watch the video again. <laughs> I hope it's not too confusing. Basically what it is, we just, deal, we just dealt with some shapes and some animations. That's literally what we did. And uh, you can see me doing everything in the video okay. um, I'm just putting all these things on screen one because I want these uh, docs to be on the first screen actually okay that's what I like to do I just like to come in here and just kind of try to figure out um, you know some different ways to get some different animations you know I really love that so if we go to the first screen here we go okay that's the first screen and then now scrolling it's going to give us that where each dock goes to its own its own area what i'm making a video junior go to sleep juni go to sleep why aren't you going to sleep no it's bedtime Go lay on your bed. Don't so, get up. That's what we got for now, guys. So stay tuned for more of the Crimson Takeover. Um, yep, that's the name of this theme, the Crimson Takeover. 
and this is going to be created live with you guys again hope it's not too confusing but if you're into the theme like me um, I'm still a beginner okay don't get me don't get it twisted don't get me wrong I'm still a beginner all right but I really like this I really like this um, it just opens up more doors to more things that can be themed um, so yeah that's gonna wrap it up for now um, Again, stay tuned for more of the Crimson Takeover. I'm your humble host, Picasso. I'll see you in the next one, guys. Peace. I'm out.